Morning. Let's talk landscape photos for a minute. Nice picture, right? Well, maybe not. What is this colored blob thing? This is the input that generated that photo. The photo isn't real. This is AI-generated art. At the click of a mouse, it can be reinterpreted. Any combination of colors and textures. It's all done in a free piece of software. This AI interpretive program, it's called Gaugan 2. It's presented by NVIDIA. So you can head over to their website, which you can find on Google, and start creating these cartoons, these colored tiles that I'm showing you. And it'll take the input that you draw and return it to you looking like a photograph. So you've been seeing me adding complexity to the basic flat color for grass. So this here is the color code for mountains, for instance, and it'll generate that scene there. So if I add a line in a color that represents water, then I will get back this river, or in this case, it almost looks like an estuary or an inlet. You know, and if I mess around a bit, add a big blue arc here, a kind of a bay, then it'll become this fjord. So it's kind of amazing, right? It's sometimes it's it's surprising if you uh, so I mess around with this input, just this random scribbling, and this is what the AI it translates it into this totally new vision. So yeah, yeah, I've been fascinating for quite a while now with uh, you know what this can do, and I wanted to take this opportunity this year to make some paintings with this technology. You know the the question I'm thinking about is. Are these scenes that I'm making from my imagination? Or, well, you know, it is literally a collaboration with the AI. It's giving me something, you know, the software is definitely enhancing my very simplistic kind of compositional design, but, you know, it is my design. So, you know, that's the fascinating question to me. Is this art created by the artist? Or, you know, how much credit do we give the software? So, Let's call it a collaboration. Fair is fair. We're doing this together, me and the program. Well, we'll see anyway. The next step is to do the watercolors. So turn in tomorrow, and I'll have the first of my experiments rolled out, and we'll see what we get.